Hi traders, as expected due to the uncertainty regarding the upcoming elections, the S&P 500 lost 1.8% last week and expected to continue its decline until Wednesday when the election results will be published. Analyst expectations are almost binary, up if Clinton wins, down if Trump wins. However, my expe expectation based on my experience and what happened in the Brexit is a little bit different. I expect a strong initial move, however, a quick pullback in a matter of hours or maybe in a matter of days back to the starting point therefore a zero sum game. Now due to the expectations of high volatility this is not the time for investors however it is a great time for traders. Let's take a technical look at the market. The S&P 500 did break down. As expected last week, we were seeing the very nice cup and handle formation and we did move down to my target, which is the 2100s. I expect the market to hold here. It is a support area, but again, until Wednesday, a bit of a decline, maybe it's going to hold its position. And then, of course, we'll wait for the big initial move after the elections. However, the market direction is down, but the elections are going to decide where the market will move next week. Let's take a look at uh, last week's picks. We had two picks last week. Apple did great. It did move under the breakdown point and is declining right now and I expect it to continue declining. We did get to our first target which is a 3% uh, uh, profit therefore you're expected to sell three quarters actually to cover. We were short cover three quarters of your quantity and hold just the last quarter. So hopefully Apple this last quarter will continue to decline. My second pick last week was Macy's short under 35. This trade did not trigger. Macy's did not get to the point where, where we should short it so so no trade in Macy's. Let's have two picks for this week. My first pick for the week is EQT short under, under 63 and 11 cents. It's an oil and gas research uh, company in the US. Very nice downside momentum. And again, I expect the momentum and uh, the trend to continue lower. So EQT for short. My second pick also for short is AWK short under $70. Uh, this company is a utility company in the US uh, providing water to 16 states. So again, nice uh, momentum nice uh, trend and short under $70. I wish you a great trading week and see you next week.